into the 90s, triple mm -hmm. digits, even 80s possibly could be behind us. Yeah. So we'll enjoy this. Today, not quite there. We're in the upper 60s, a couple of degrees shy of that 70 degree mark. But Abby, you see tomorrow, tomorrow is going to be the warm one. Today's probably the sunnier one. Today's actually my pick day. Then we get up to 74. Then there's a front that comes through Friday morning, and it's going to drop our temperature. Our low temperature Thursday night, 54. That'll be the high temperature, you know, when you, during the morning commute. We'll fall into the upper 40s. We'll fall by the evening into the middle 40s here in Syracuse. Plus, there'll be some wind and a chance for some rain showers. Quite a bit different from the next two days. Seize them. Over the weekend, we're still chilly on Saturday with some breeze. A couple of showers, especially east of Lake Ontario. And then as we go into Sunday, we start to dry out and the temperatures start to rebound, at least closer to typical level, which is at about 65 now. We've got a low pressure system on the east coast. Still been tracking high pressure just to the north and west. It's been a battle between the two, giving us some cloud cover and some rain, especially south southeast. And you can see there are some showers in Shenango and Otsego County. That's about as close as they'll come as this low pressure system will be shortly moving on out. It's just been sitting and spinning. It'll move on out. We have that high pressure giving us a good amount of sunshine north and west of Syracuse today in those areas south and east where it's overcast to start. We will be turning mostly sunny by later this afternoon and that'll allow those temperatures to start to go up. So figure close to 70 in some spots where we see the most sunshine mid 60s further to the southeast when you start to break out into that sun later today and then a couple of degrees warmer for tomorrow 5 to 10 degrees warmer. So here we are this afternoon or going in this into this late morning. Low 50s, mid 50s up in Watertown with bright sunshine this morning. Closer to 50 here where we have the cloud cover and a couple of stray rain showers still ongoing. We'll be dry by the noon hour as we go into the afternoon. Those clouds eroding to our south and east. Temperatures pushing the upper 60s here in Syracuse. Cooling back down into the 40s tonight under a mainly clear sky with light winds. Light winds tomorrow morning, moderating temperatures with sunshine. It's going to be beautiful. Maybe not quite as bright and sunny as we go through the afternoon. As clouds start to increase from the cold front, temperatures making the mid 70s. We'll be dry during the daytime tomorrow. A few showers are possible after sunset, especially after 9 or 10 o'clock. You can see some of them breaking out. Most of the rain along the cold front that comes through on Friday morning will be in the mid 50s. Temperatures falling, though, through the 40s as we go through the afternoon with lake effect rain showers developing. And there could even be some snowflakes mixing in for the Tug Hill, the Adirondacks as we go through later Friday night and Saturday morning. So 68 today, my pick day with that sunshine developing. If you don't already have it, 74 for tomorrow with increasing clouds. we got super dirt week going on. Shouldn't have any problems today or tomorrow. Bundle up if you're camping here as we get later into the week with those falling temperatures, the showers, the wind, a few showers on Saturday, especially in the morning and especially up north of Syracuse. As we go into Sunday, we're drying out 60, moderating temperatures into the middle of next week. By next Tuesday, sun and clouds in 66. Abby.